Hey everyone, what's up? It's me, the Phenomenal One, and welcome back to an episode of My Universe Mode. We are here back on NXT, and a week ago, we saw a new NXT champion in Bobby Roode, and which had a huge, huge change in the way NXT is going to run. So let's start our show off with a little bit of self-promotion by Cassius Oh no. Next, Cassius Oh no. I guess he caught out something and wanted a match, because he has it against Akira Tozawa. And Cassius Ono, our former NXT champ, or a former NXT champion, even though it was only for like less than a week, <laughs> being able to defeat him. And now we are here to watch this match, the debuting Tony Hold Storm. On we have singles action coming up next. This should be a huge we match for Tony Storm, but she can defeat Billy Kay. And if not, Billy Kay and Peyton Royce could gain some momentum heading into a possible the women's championship match. Because Billy Kay was unable, was she? I don't even remember, but they have been wanting some momentum so far, and Tony, Tony Storm making her debut finally here. A very long-awaited wrestler that WWE has been wanting for a long time, as well as a lot of other women which we'll be seeing debut around the same time. But right now, Tony Storm is the beginning of this newer women revolution. In NXT. And this match begins. And here she comes. Tony Storm. Time to make her debut here in NXT to make a name for herself. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making her way to the ring from Australia, Tony Storm. As we ready for singles action. Byron Making her way, Tony Storm, a very strong style kind of woman competitor. And next up, we see the team of the icons, Billy Kay and Peyton Royce. And her Billy Kay with Peyton Royce making her way down. From Sydney, Billy Kay. One on one action coming up here, guys, and I'm willing to bet this will be one. Billy be Kay soon ready that. tonight totally to make a Michael. move. Can she defeat Tony Storm? They're debuting Tony Storm. Tony Storm, Billy Kay, and this match begins. Well, wait, what's Billy Kay looking to do? Walking straight up to Tony Storm and showing off. Dang, this woman is trash. And Tony Storm going to celebrate right now. But wait, oh, now Billy Kay started her way down. Trying to take out Tony Storm. Wait, wait, Tony Storm into a pin. And no, no, no. Tony Storm able to get out of it. Wait, oh, she was going for a forearm, but Tony Storm able to get out of it just in time. And the leg drop connecting. And now dropping Billy Kay. Going to the top rope now. Oh, and landing right on top of her. Billy Kay getting up just in time, though. Barely getting the more damage done. That would have been a lot worse if she was down below. A huge just kick to the neck, or a leg to the neck. My bad. But Billy Kay continuing on. The offense taking on top of her. This cannot be good for her. Wait, wait. Billy Kay with a knee to the face now. This is where Billy Kay can start taking some offense. And dropping the leg straight on to Tony Storm. Right in the middle of her stomach. And oh, a huge hurricanrana. And showing off one more time. This time to the crowd instead of just to Tony Storm. Now the big long leg of Billy Kay. That's the way it's gonna be the rest of the way. Oh. 
Oh, and a huge kick to the face now. And a leg drop once more. Going to the top rope again to get another leg drop. This might just be what she needs to put her over the top, believe it or not. These women are so evenly matched at this point, guys. Oh no, Billy Kay moving out of the way. And she lands a ferocious elbow. And no, Tony Storm get out of it once again and a huge knee to the face now. And a leg drop once more. One more leg drop. And now. Oh, picking her down. The ref getting distracted though. Looking for the exclamation point. And dropping it straight on her head. Going for the pin. No, the ref getting distracted now by Billy Kay. Oh, and the ref taken down as well. Billy Kay down, the ref down, Peyton Royce just getting back up. Billy Kay may be out of it. Oh, she went for the arm. Not close enough, though. And now they're going right after each other. She's gonna go for the pin. One. And no, only a one count right now. It seems like she's able to recuperate. And now picking up the head and taking her down. She needs to find a way to turn things around fast. Well, unfortunately, Wait. Her, Billy Kay dropping her down. And now, gonna pick her up and throw her down to the head. Is it, is it over? Tony Storm may be injured. Wait, wait, no! Tony Storm able to come back from it. And once again, taking her down. That may be enough. Going for the pin. One, two, and no, oh, Billy Kay kicking out. Once more, will this be able to hit it? And the pile driver connects once more. Going for the pin again. One, two, three. And Peyton Royce unable to help her partner Billy Kay get the victory as Tony Storm makes a huge debut here tonight. Big victory for Tony Storm tonight. And that may help her get some momentum as her first match winning because Asuka currently has no challengers so the question is who can Asuka challenge? This match all over the place but in the end Tony Storm making the big comeback to become the new or the winner. And big win tonight for Tony Storm. The two of them put down so much and big. <laughs> looks like Peyton Royce pretty mad. Yet to see Peyton Royce really fight recently. It's mainly been Billy Kay. One match is in the books and we're on to the next. The next up we have Johnny Gargano and Tommaso Ciampa of DIY taking on Eric Young and Killian Dane of Sanity and I will now confirm that Sanity and DIY this match will be the number one contender so whoever wins this tag team championship match we have later tonight in our main event will be facing off against whoever wins this and Sanity have beaten the team of Johnny Gargano and Tommaso Ciampa big victory here tonight for them and whoever wins this match will be challenging them the championship is up for grabs. Coming up next. But now we have Justin Gabriel and Tyson Kidd of International Airstrike to take on the Revival. This could be a huge matchup for one of these men. Or two of these men, actually. Because if the Revival wins, they'll be the first ever two-time tag team champions. Something we have yet to see here in my universe mode.
Justin Gabriel and Tyson Kidd, ever since coming back to NXT, they've been on a roll lately, unable to get the victories last week, but since then, which actually got DIY the chance to become the contenders, but since then, they've been pretty good. They've been changing up how the career was, Justin Gabriel getting signed back to the WWE and NXT for developmental reasons. The more have changed how their career has been going so far. But here comes the revival. Big victory tonight could help them. But now we have our current NXT Tag Team Champions in the form of Tama or not Tama Tyson Kidd and Justin Gabriel. Here they come. Listen to this crowd, guys. They're fired up for this one, as well as they should be. This match has instant... The pair are getting a little excited here tonight, it seems. Guys, I think we can all agree that this is easily one of the biggest matches of the champ's career. And Cole, that's really saying something. This could be a huge way for them to cement themselves. Competing up till now. Remember, NXT Championship is on the line tonight. We know that Sanity is a new number 10, so no matter what, Sanity will be challenging the champions. So this is going to be the last fight between these two teams. And here comes the team of Justin Gabriel and Tyson Kidd. Team ready here tonight. Championships are on the line. This is going to be a huge main match. We saw the title change hand in the next T, the main one. And now Dash Wilder taking down. He was talking to his tag team partner. And now with Tyson Kitt or Justin Gabriel looking for stop it on him. And, oh, stepping on the arm. Wait, wait, wait. Dash Wilder getting out of it and taking him down. And now taking out Tyson Kidd as well. Oh, and a huge, oh, a clothesline to the back. That's huge. Now, oh, elbow to the head. This is where he's able to start taking some more offense down. Taking Justin Gabriel out may be the best bet right now. Take out their biggest high flyer they have. Tyson Kidd, more of a technical type of wrestler. He is underweight, and for the cruiserweights, he can become a future cruiserweight. But right now, he's been focusing more on the NXT Tag Team division. Mm. NXT chance going wild now. Wait, wait. Oh, Justin Gabriel trying to go for the tag along with Tyson Kidd. Tyson Kidd unable to reach Justin Gabriel now. Tyson Kidd out of reach. He's going to tag in Scott Dawson. Oh my god, now they're just going to assault the team of Justin Gabriel. Now, Scott Dawson picking him up. He put some on that one. Showing off just a bit. Looking straight at him. He's talking trash to a kid, but watch out, Justin Gabriel here right now. 
And Justin Gabriel gonna drop down. Scott Dawson. And he looks helpless after that injury. Jumping back in the ring. He's gonna tag in his tag team partner. Oh, and flying high, kicking out. Scott Dawson. This kid seems to be have hurt himself a little more though. Back now inside the ring. Three count. And he's gonna go flying. Going for the pin now. No, no, no. Not yet. And throwing him down. The revival making a big comeback, possibly needed. And now tagging in his tag team partner, Dash Wilder, back in the ring. And once again, going to continue the assault. This time, Dash Wilder taking the legs out. Ooh. Wait, oh, Tessa can hit him in the face, though. And I'll go for the pin. But the rope break getting him out of it. Oh. Drop him down. Can Tyson Kidd make this though? That's the question. And going for the pin as well. One. Two. Three. No, no, no. Almost a three count. Going tagging Justin Gabriel. And Justin Gabriel makes his way into the ring now. Oh, flying high and getting some more offense down. And now, he got the arm of Dash Wilder. Oh, wait, Dash Wilder getting out of it. Dash Wilder going to continue the offense. Wait, wait. No. Wait, chipping up the legs now. I'm going for the leg lock. Is he going to be able to make him tap out? No, he's trying to go for it. He's trying to go for it. Try tagging his partner, but no. Scott Dawson now, knowing he won't be able to tag his partner like this. And take him down. What a huge kick. Wait, no. Tag it in. And now Tyson Kidd in this match. Going to the top rope. What does he have planned now? And now waiting for him to get up. And kick him down. Trying to distract the ref. And the ropes. He was able to grab the ropes. And Dash Water going to trip him out. Dash Water getting down. Oh, is this going to be enough? Is this going to be enough? He's still going. He's still going. And no, no. Tessa keep getting out of it. He's trying to pop out. Can he do it? Yes, he got out of it. Oh. And now, feeling happy about what he's been accomplishing now. Man, 
great. Tyson Kit getting out of it. Oh. He's in a tough spot here, Corey. And if he doesn't get up, he has to wait for Justin Gabriel. Justin Gabriel slowly climbing to the top. And going for the pin. One, two, three. And International Airstrike is still your tag team champions. Big win for International Airstrike tonight. Able to retain their NXT tag team titles, but now they have to wonder, will they be able to de defeat Sanity? Because Sanity at the next takeover will be their next challenge. So it's a question of can they? But tonight they could go home and get some good rest because they are still NXT Tag Team Champions. Big victory here tonight for these two teams or these two team or this team. The question is what's next for the revival? Are they still gonna stay here in NXT and go after some titles? Or do they have something bigger planned in mind? Such big things to wonder. But thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this episode, make sure you like button and subscribe. And until next episode, guys, I'm out.